All right, so we're back in Baldur's Gate 3. I think this is the fourth episode. We just got to the crypt and realized very quickly that there actually is damage types. So I have the, the I have both the club and a, a sword. I actually bought this battle axe, which is I don't think going to be incredibly helpful down here because the skeletons take extra damage. Yeah, you, this one I'm over here. From, from these. So these take extra damage from the hand, one handed blunt. Oh, shit. Oh my god, I'm about to die. I was not paying attention at all. Because these skeletons take about half damage from my normal slashing attacks. So using a shittier weapon. You know, I spent like all of the gold I had. Oh my god. This one's not even dead. It's head popped off though. What the fuck? This game was okay. I This is not what I expected from a game made in 19 uh no, 2001. 2001, I think. Uh let's go ahead and save this. Why not? So I'm actually going to be going away when by the time this this launches, I will be out of town. I'll be I'll be away for about a week, but I wanted you to have some content while I was gone. I'm going to to VidCon so I can learn better how to make how to make content you actually enjoy. <laughs> Essentially, I'm, I'm going to to training to let's just let's just try this. See, it does, it does so little damage. Oh my god, I need to get out of that. Oh shit. Okay, I need to get the fuck out of that. That's not... <laughs> that was dangerous. Uh, let's switch back to this, I think. Should probably use a shield. I just whistled when saying that, but that's okay. Uh, are these better? No, those are the same. What is this? Why is it zero? What is the point of that? Is it just for fashion? Just just the fashionable way to do it? Okay, I'm gonna have to stick with this club unless I get something better. I just think it's I think better overall is what's important here. We're gonna try and be a little bit more conscientious about our potions because that's one thing I've noticed is I am going through potions like crazy in this hard difficulty and it's getting me into some trouble. OK, I didn't trust that skeleton. I don't trust any of these skeletons. Wait, how do I go? Oh, it's over here. OK, no, one at a time. Use the door to your advantage. And heal. Jeez. I just want to remind everybody, this is like level three, level two of the game, and I am, I am struggling quite a bit. This does not bode well for the rest of the game, especially because I seem to remember like there is a huge gear like bloat, but it's at the very end of the game when it doesn't really matter anymore. But this is also my memory from when I was what? How old am I? I, I? I was a kid. I was I was a young kid. So it's coming from a time period where my memory was a little faulty. It looks excuse. Oh shit. Oh my god. Just dodge. Dodge. Whew. Dodge. Nope. Okay. Circles. God, the zombies have so much health. I don't. Are they even hitting me though? Or like they. I mean, they're running at me with no arms, no head, and just kind of. <laughs> I don't know. And the ghosts are just kind of atmospheric, I think. Oh my gosh. At least for now. Wow, there are so many. There are just so many enemies. I'm 
I'm trying not to get stuck in the middle between both of them because that has the potential to end up very, very poorly for me. That's... No, not allowed. That one got me twice. Did you forget where I was? Honestly, these have seemed to be easier than the the kobolds before, and I think part of that is the size. Is they're they're bigger targets to hit. Size does matter, apparently. Is, is what I'm getting at here. Now, if you were if you were here for the last episode, I actually did live stream that. This one I am not just because of a time constraint. Uh, you know, I am leaving today. But I will I will plan to live stream these some more in the future because I thought that was fun to do and it, it kind of works in the same way. They're all going to go in the same playlist. So you'll be able to see all the episodes all together. Uh, let's save. And, and we'll be able to just kind of play through the entirety of the game together, either through VODs or or live on stream. Uh. With each probably being about an hour, hour long. But thank you everyone who does enjoy these. This is different content for my usual. I, I, I don't generally tend to do these Let's Plays. Listen. Oh. Excuse you. You have too many arms. Thank you. Are you alive? Are you? Oh, no, that's just a death animation. Come on. I was waiting to see. If oh my god, I'm almost dead. God, uh, <laughs> I was not watching my health at all. <laughs> I was <laughs> I was too busy watching the death animations. Oh god, I'm stuck in between. Ah. Okay. Ah. <laughs> this game, if you do not pay attention, it, it, it's actually a little bit difficult to stream. Uh, on hard difficulty because of that reason. Uh, is there anything, any, any loot for us? Any reward for, for clearing out this room? Except for, I guess, a wooden shield, I guess. Five gold. Okay. All right. Well, the, these ghosts aren't an issue. They're going to like turn on me. I know they are like, it's just like, it's going to happen. Screw that room. I need like a skill. Oh god, I'm stuck. Should probably block. I have not used my shield like at all. I'm jumping more than anything. Oh my god. There's so many of these. I do think if you plan on playing this game, it does make it more fun to play it on hard difficulty. Just because there's an added level of challenge and, and you do have to focus a little bit on, on not dying terribly. As you get the hang of the game, like I definitely feel like I'm doing better now. You have no head or arms. This feels... Wow, okay. Did it even attack me? I don't even know if it attacked me. Did I just... Was I just mean to that poor zombie? I feel kind of like a, an ass now. Like, I'm sorry. Oh, there's no door there. There's no door! I thought there was a door. I thought I could... Yep. This is why saving often is important. <laughs> Please tell me. Please tell me I saved that last save spot, which is just just two rooms back. Just two rooms back. I think we did. I think we did. No, I didn't save after clearing this room, but I did still save. Oh, 
I wonder if they their damage goes down once they lose some of their body parts. They seem less threatening. Actually, oh my gosh. I'm so close to dying. I am not watching my health bar at all. Let's save. Jeez, okay. Do you see my health? I really should get a ranged weapon, shouldn't I? I am close to leveling though, please. I'm, I'm, I'm pretty close to leveling anyway. No, no, no. Stay over there. Run away. Did I have this much trouble the first time I cleared this room out? I don't think I did. There is, I remember, like one of the things I remember from, from my childhood playing this game is I think that there's like, I don't remember if it was a code, uh, when you actually you know, had like cheat codes and stuff for games, when you, you would like, and had like the game shark was sold, like, you know, all that stuff, but, or if it was just something you got after you beat the game, which that might be it, you got to play as Drist, uh, from, from the, from Ari Salvatore's books, which was really freaking cool. And still would be cool today. So if we have that bonus mission at the end, we'll play it. <laughs> Woo. This is intense, y'all. Yeah. I probably shouldn't be switching targets. That's probably a bad mistake because then I'm opening myself up to taking extra damage unnecessarily. I'll just focus on killing one. Which I immediately don't do. Because why would I folk why would I listen to my own why would I listen to my own thought process? That would Okay, that's rude. Woo. Oh man. <laughs> this is intense. I am close to leveling, not that it's gonna make that much of a difference. It is, it does fit the whole RPG narrative though. I mean, you definitely continuously get stronger. There is a point to me killing everything because I'm getting experience, I'm getting gold. It makes, it makes progression feel important, which is something I really love in, in these kind of RPGs. Like, yes, there is a, there's a story and it's an interesting story. Right now it's feeling more like a mystery than like any kind of like big story. Uh, we don't know a whole lot of things that are going on. We just know that there is an orb that is making all these things come to life when they shouldn't be coming to life. Although this is called the freaking Shrine of Suffering, which why would you name the place where you bury your dead the Shrine of Suffering? Also, there are a ton of skeletons that are just kind of like on the wall. What makes you get like either you get a coffin or you get stuffed in the wall. What like what makes like they're 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 stacked up like like freaking freaking wood for a fire. Maybe that's why it's the shrine of suffering. Maybe it's just like everyone's pissed off because they got they got stacked up like wood. Level up. Oh, I get to do strength. Uh oh no, I get to do my stats. Okay, so I got melee attack plus one damage. That would be very helpful. But the other one I'm thinking about is health because I am struggling so much with health. Do I want more constitution or more strength? My strength is higher. Let's do let's do constitution for now. I got three points, but everything I've been doing so far tends to be towards like surviving longer. A sword and fist plus one to hit and plus one damage for each rank obtained. Shield expert. Um, intestinal fortitude. Death blow. The feat causes critical hits to deal more damage. What is bull rush? 
a short, powerful charge that inflicts tremendous damage. That would be helpful. This feat increases your carrying capacity. That's for later. Toughness, we've already got one toughness. The feat provides a targeting line to make aiming easier. Don't need that. The feat improves the accuracy of your ranged attacks. Don't need that. Which I think this is also part of your class, like the amount of times that you can upgrade things. I think we'll go ahead. Let's get Bull Rush. But how do I use it? How do I how do I use Bull Rush? It's not that. That was a waste of a potion. Okay. How do I use Bull Rush? Where's controls? Oh, I wish there was someone playing with me. <laughs> that would be wonderful. Okay. Magic. Left shift, left mouse. Would it count as magic? Maybe? But let's... Okay, let's see. I don't see it anywhere else. Action? No. I think, I think it's, that's the magic. Except, this is my left mouse. I don't know how to use it. I'm sure it'd be very helpful right now. Oh my gosh, okay. This is unfortunate. I should not do this. I should go away. I should I should retreat. I should go retreat away from all this bullshit, which is not very helpful right now. I need to figure out how to do my bull rush. I really got to figure that out. Next spell, down arrow. If I have to use down arrow, that would suck. <laughs> Honestly. Previous spell, up arrow. Like, that would be really bad. I wonder, should I try and do this with a, a remote? Maybe next time? Okay, that's that. But how do I use the spell? There's, there's got to be a simple way. Attack, left mouse, left shift, press, plus, plus, I can talk. Look, okay, we beat the game now. We figured out how to use it. We're fine now. Let's try it out. Oh, oh okay, that's really cool. <laughs> I just used all of them on. That's fine, though. That was really cool. I like that. Okay. This is a lot of damage, honestly. I kind of wish it stunned them, though. It doesn't seem to stun them. Wow, the health potions aren't really healing me as much anymore, either. I reached the point where they are less useful each heal and I need better potions. Is there no way? Wait, where do I go? This whole room and there's no no way out? Um was this an unnecessary path? Did I not need to go through here? I maybe I go down now. I no, because that was. I'm confused. Okay, let's go save anyway. The crypt level ones. So there's another level at least to this crypt. Okay. Oh, maybe we need to go up. Maybe that wasn't necessary. Maybe that was the wrong way. Maybe this is the right way up here. Oh god. Okay, you sh they shouldn't be able to shoot through each other. I'm just saying. That feels a little unfair. <laughs> oh, 
Oh, I did it after he died. Okay. There we go. That one shot it. I'll take it. I'll take the one shot. Where's the, where's the, there you are. God, I can't even really see you in this dark little corner. It was smart. Okay, so we've got a couple different. Woo! There's a lot. There's a whole lot over there. Let's let's go through here and fight one at a time. Wow, you have a lot of health. Skeleton. There's another one just chilling over there. I meant to charge, instead I jump. I did not want to get stuck in the middle there. I did not mean to use that potion either, but that's okay. That time I did mean to use the potion. This is, oh my god. A save right here. Thank. Oh my gosh. Okay. <laughs> uh, you're just wandering around with no. Yep. I'm, just wandering around with no no health or health. Uh, no 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 body parts. No head. So many. You're not just gonna sit there and take pop shots at me. This was a bad idea. This was vengeful. This was just me being vengeful. That's okay. Maybe not as okay as I thought it was. I died as as I died as a warrior should, charging into battle, foolhardy and strong. I don't know. Most of this full hardy. Oh, spear. Not that I think that'll help at all because I need a blunt weapon in here. Ooh. They don't give much experience at all. Like you can see up in the top left corner, that's my the little green bar the little green bar, that's my experience, and it does not seem to be going very well at all. <laughs> it's it's kinda inching its way very slowly towards the next level. Very much feels like a muted version of Diablo. It, it it's got the ARPG feel to it, but there's just there's something there's something different to it, and I can't really place my finger on exactly what the difference is from this and, and a Diablo game. Or like other ARPGs. Perhaps it's just, I don't know, maybe I will get super strong eventually and just mow down tons and tons of enemy. You know, kind of live out that tremendous power fantasy is what, which is what, you know, Diablo and, and other ARPGs are known for. But at the moment, I feel pretty freaking weak. And hordes of enemies are terrifying. Is there any anything hidden in here? No, no goodies. Uh, I should probably look at my gear. Let's see. Do I have any new armor that's actually better? Doesn't look like it. I don't think that was five. What was I wearing? Five. <laughs> Any kind of spear, club two to three, fine staff two to nine. Let's try the, the fine staff. Kind of like a, a monk. Which actually you do get a monk in the second in the sequel to this. The monk is really cool. It's a it's a drow monk. Oh shit. Come on. 
I forgot about you, sorry. They've just been wandering around in here this whole time. Not bad. Reminds me of uh, if if you saw the Dungeons and Dragons movie, which if you haven't seen the Dungeons and Dragons movie yet, I highly, highly recommend it. But there is a part in that. If you did see it, you know exactly what part I'm talking about. Uh, an undead being left. But I, I would I would recommend going to see that, that movie if you haven't already. It was fantastic. And I really hope we get a sequel. Fuck me. Okay, the staff is good. I like the staff. I like the staff a lot. I'm hitting for like six occasionally, but for the most part, I'm hitting much harder. It is slower, which that's, I guess, the other part of it that you don't really see in the damage is the, the slowness. It does make a difference, you know, how quickly you can spam your mouse keys, but. Ooh, a Warhammer. Okay, that might be a hell of a lot better than this staff. Or it might be like nothing at all, let's see. I think we can just scroll, Warhammer, one to eight. And it's worse, right? Yeah, it's worse. Never mind, it is much worse than the staff. Maybe if it was a fine Warhammer, this is a fine staff, so the quality matters. Excuse you. Oh yeah, I forgot about this. And this. And this. It's a lot of fun, I'm not gonna lie. It's a lot of fun just randomly charging at them. Except when I press the, the heal button instead on accident. And then I run out of potions because I pressed the heal button on accident. Shit. I'm already out of potions. Oh, I don't know that we're, I was hope like my idea was, okay, every playthrough, we're going to get through like a certain area. I don't know that we're getting through the crypts in this playthrough. Especially not without, with, with so few. Oh, what's it called? Potions. Ooh, almost died there. And I missed. Unfortunate. Oh, they missed. Very fortunate. Shit, okay. How are there so many undead? Man, like... This is, this is just, this is like the French catacombs. Just so many dead people. And they all want to party. That was interesting. That's not the potion I need. Ooh. I have no health. I have no health. I have no health at all. This is like, this is a terrible idea. I don't know why I keep doing this. What is the point? Of, like, this isn't going to make a difference. Okay, I wonder. Ah, should I keep pressing on? Pressing? Pressing on? Or. Should I really kind of, like, kind of cut my losses here and go and get some more potions? I have I have plenty of money. What time are we at? I have plenty of money. If we're going to finish this level within the next 30 minutes, I think I really have to go and, and, and recall. I think it's the smart thing to do. Get some more potions. This isn't the place for that. Have him say that I smell bad. What are you looking for? Sell this stuff. The scimitar I want to keep. 
Get rid of the spiked club, because I think I'm good with the Our staff at this point. I can get rid of that. From the sunset that. I wonder... Swords, axes, bows, what can I buy? I have, three, I have a lot of gold now. All right. Oh, I forgot I have all these things to sell, too. <laughs> Not many of them, but... I do have a shit ton of these I can sell. Wow. They're not selling very... I can't, I can't like, sell quality? No. Damn, a lot. I need, like, that many health potions, to be honest. Okay. Healing potion. Let's do about... to 2,500. Yes, I know. I stink. I got it. I understand. Okay. Do I want to get a ring or more? I mean, this would be a huge upgrade. It's from 5 to 12. Let's do it. Let's do it. Why not? It's maybe wasted my money. But I also look cooler now. This <laughs> isn't the place for that. Okay, let's uh Our shop no 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 sell 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 oh. weapons brought here all the way from the sun all right let's go what is the fastest way to get back down there save over that what is the fastest way is it going to just be going it probably is going back down over here because this gets me down to the lower levels of the sewers, and then I can just kind of keep going. It's going to take a sec to run through, because I have to run all the way down to the, the crypt. But this should at least get me lower. Like, it's right here, and then to the level 2 sewers. It should all be empty. I think, yep, everything's still dead. And then we just have to run to the... Do I have an actual map? I just have that mini map. I don't have an actual map map. So this is where we have to just run all the way back. Uh, was it north? Is it the north? Oh, it doesn't matter. I think we just go north. Follow the save points. Probably, you know, just a fantastic idea. Remember how terrifying all this stuff was? And eventually, like, everything that's terrifying right now is not going to be terrifying. It'll all be easy. This is working out perfectly. I am just, no. I am just dodging all, I don't even have to stop. I just timed it somehow without thinking like it just worked. <laughs> it just somehow worked. No, so the, the thing is like, so we're playing Baldur's Gate Dark Alliance and with Baldur's Gate 3 on the way, I was really tempted to instead play the, the mainline Baldur's Gate games. But I'm actually, I think, going to do a quick video before I leave. If I have if I have the time for it. On the oh wait. No, no. Am I stuck? Excuse you. Shh. Okay. God damn. <laughs> uh what was I saying? Sorry. So they Baldur's Gate 3 has a a mini, like a prequel that's coming out. And actually, you, it updates every day, and it's one that we can all kind of do together. So I'll make a video on it, I think, real quick. If I can get it done before I leave uh, today. It's all about, um, like, a murder mystery in Baldur's Gate 3. So a murder mystery, I think it's in Baldur's Gate. I think it's when I haven't opened the game yet, so I wanted to take a look and see what it actually has, has to offer. But it sounds exciting, and I'm glad it's something they're doing. All right, let's go wreck some faces. Stop. So I'm getting stunned from them hitting me. This is bad. This is bad. There are so many arrows everywhere. So many. 
This is unnecessary. Huh? Oh, it's a bomb. <laughs> the chest was a bomb. Not a not a mimic, just a freaking bomb. Oh my god. Oh god. No 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 no. There we go. There we go. It really should stun them. Honestly, the bull rush should stun them. I wonder if it gets a stun later, like as as part of the level up process. If it's not just, is that just the same armor? Please don't say that was just the armor that I bought. Please don't say. Okay, no, it's worn pattern. <laughs> it's the it's the armor I sold. The armor that I, I previously had. I can't do anything with that. Oh, hidden potion. This is another dead end. Okay, so I guess I need to go up. Is that the way? Hopefully. Let's go up. These are really expansive levels. Like the, the play time of this game. So the, the time to beat for this game is only 12 hours. For me, I, it will probably be longer just because I'm slower. And uh, and I think that I mean, I would I would generally say that when you add difficulty by like up, bumping up the difficulty, it's it'll it'll go slower. I mean, that's also probably just me. <laughs> that's probably just me making excuses, but that's OK. OK, that one was good. You didn't get any attacks off on me. Let's go down and around. Get ready to bull charge. I must have done damage to that one. That's really cool because it looks like it saves the damage you did beforehand. Like nothing's respawning, right? So everything is kind of the same as when you left it. I wonder if that works for bosses too. No, it didn't work for bosses. We, we figured that part out. I think I just got better, better gloves, maybe. I did not mean to use that potion. That's okay though. Okay, so I've got right now. I've got leather boots with two armor, leather studded leather gloves is probably gonna be the best. At three, yeah, everything I got is crap. <laughs> of course, it's crap because that's how this game works. Although the weapons, I've been able to find some really good weapons. But right now, my best two resources seem to be money and health potions. Oh god. I do can't, I'm I am enjoying killing the zombies more than I should. I kind of wish the skeletons would react the same way, like lose bones. Is this another room that's empty? Y'all, where, where do I go? <laughs> I feel like I've explored the whole crypt. Where the hell do I go? Oh, and mouse button works as well, not just up arrow. Just found that out. Okay, so that I've explored all of this. Where do I need to go? That room is a no. That room is a no. As we'll save. Save early, save often. This thing <laughs> you will regret not saving in this game. That one's a no. That's a no. That's the way I came in, I think, right? No, oh, gold. Yes, please. Where, where do I need to go? I think I've already come down here and it's a dead end. So I must be missing something. I must be missing. I yeah, see that's a dead end. I think I've, I feel like I've killed everything in the crypt too. Like there's not a whole lot left. This is when I really need like a, a sprint button. 
Did I miss, a, like, a direction over here? Or is this just... If there's not one that goes, like, farther north, is there? No, there isn't. Oh, jeez. <laughs> I don't know where to go. Um, maybe did I miss something up here to the left? I don't think I did, but and I'll be able to find out soon. No, it's it's a dead end too. Come on, I hunger for action. Excuse you. I wish I could also like raise the dialogue volume. The dialogue volume is pretty low in this game. But I wanted to kind of get acquainted with the the lore and the the world of Baldur's Gate before jumping back into Baldur's Gate three, which was just. If you haven't played Baldur's Gate 3 yet, it's such a good game. It really is such a good game. Oh, health potions and gold. I am very excited for what they're going to be able to offer. It's it's gonna, it's obviously very different from this. It is more tactical combat. It's turn-based combat. There's there's a zombie just chilling in there. It's tactical turn-based combat, so it's very very different but it's different in a great fun way. And the, the humor and lore to the game is top notch. Larian is a great studio. They've made, they made Divinity Original Sin, Divinity Original Sin 2, and they're doing a really good job so far with Baldur's Gate 3. I am, I am truly, truly not certain where I need to go. I feel like I've been everywhere. Uh, <laughs> what am I missing? It's going to be somewhere obvious, isn't it? It's going to be somewhere like incredibly obvious that I just missed. The di the hard difficulty in this game is my brain and my 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 struggles. This just ends, right? This is another dead end. Another dead end. They're all dead. Got to be missing something. Let's keep going. You know, head north. Sewers was north both times. Let's head north. There was obviously, I think there was like a lot of optional rooms, obviously, in this. And I just miss, I'm just missing the right place. This is the last room I was in. Arrows. What the fuck is this? What is that? Huh. This. There's right there. Wait, but that's up to town. I mean, it's still helpful. But that's the town. Shit, where do I go? Uh, let's see. What do these do? Nothing? Wait, are there... Is it a puzzle? Is it a puzzle? Y'all, I couldn't destroy these. I have a theory. I have a theory.